Oregon is really an absolutely beautiful place to live and inhabited by wonderful people and that makes it a great place to practice law. Being able to instill in our young lawyers this commitment to civility, to professionalism and collegiality I think is one of our highest missions. We have uh, three wonderful law schools in Oregon, but law school is dedicated toward academics and law practice is much more than that. I think one of the biggest challenges as a new lawyer is that there's so much to learn in being in practice and you don't even know where to look for those answers. In law school you learn how to interpret the law, how to read the law, and how to make an argument, but you don't really understand how to practice law, which involves filing things and formatting things and um, paying fees and, and, and those types of things. If we didn't do this mentorship program, we would lose some of the best future lawyers in this state. It's so hard to make the transition from law school into the profession, and that's our goal, to help them get there and stay there. The goal of the Oregon State Bar Mentoring Plan is to guide new lawyers through the practical aspects of law practice and to promote the ideals of professionalism and competence that lead to successful and rewarding careers. This program is designed to give the new lawyer and the mentor as much flexibility as possible in designing the program to meet their particular needs. There are six component parts to the mentoring program. The first part of the program is to introduce and connect new lawyers to the broad legal community. The second part of the mentoring program covers the rules of professional conduct and the standards of professionalism. The third part is an introduction to law office management. The fourth part of the program involves working with clients. The fifth part addresses career satisfaction and work-life balance. And the sixth part of the mentoring program focuses on practice area activities. There are 20 practice areas, and each new lawyer and mentor will choose 10 activities from their chosen area of focus. As the journey begins between the mentor and the new lawyer, here are some tips to keep in mind. It's really helpful to bring the practice to life for your new lawyer. Uh, bring them to a hearing or a trial, uh, an arbitration, whatever. They'll be much more uh, excited about the practice of law and given an opportunity to see how you do things. Cultivate a relationship where they can be open, they can feel that there's a trusted environment where they can speak their mind and ask the questions that they probably would feel embarrassed to ask in their work group or their law firms. New lawyers are often pretty intimidated to contact someone senior. So as a new mentor, you need to take the initiative to contact them and set up the appointments. And then when you do, spend some time getting to know them. If you're mentoring a, a lawyer of color or a diverse attorney, um, an important tip is that mentorship isn't about how to make this person be like you. It's recognizing their uniqueness and figuring out how to support that and how to make them feel welcome in the community and to help develop them as a lawyer in their own unique way. You become a successful lawyer when you're engaging in the highest level of civility. It's, it's what we need to, to teach young lawyers so that they recognize that winning isn't achieved through being mean to anybody. My hope for the new lawyers is that they get more than someone who just takes them out to lunch once a month, that they have a resource to call and ask questions that they have, someone who will help them with business development, introduce them to their colleagues, take them to events, uh, give them ideas for how to become involved in the community. For our mentors, it's really that opportunity to take those things from their practice, those pearls of wisdom that they've learned through the School of Hard Knocks, and to share those with the new lawyer. What mentors get out of the experience is an incredible ego boost. <laughs> it is simply fun. When for so many years we didn't know what we were doing, to now be able to be in a position to say to somebody, that's a really difficult situation, and I have some ideas for you. We want new lawyers to learn about the 
fantastic legal culture in Oregon where people actually get along with each other though they're on different sides of disputes. We want them to learn professionalism, we want them to be civil, and we want them to enjoy practicing law in the best place in America to be a lawyer. I hope that this mentoring program will preserve the uniqueness of the Oregon State Bar, that it will preserve into the future uh, our civility, our collegiality, and our professionalism that we're known for here in Oregon. Thank you.